Okay, this is another one of my favorite roles that I got to do two years ago, I think. And this is Traviata, and you may recognize some of it. Um, Violetta is also an expensive girlfriend, and she's the best. Um, and she has just met a broke guy, which is terrible for business. Um, and but she's, you know, she's, she loves him immediately as these things go. And um, she, <laughs> so the first half of this aria, you'll hear this kind of, oh my God, love is the very best. It's the heartbeat of the universe. It's amazing. I am totally in love and oh, it's gonna be great. And then about halfway through, she literally says the word folly, folly. This is delirious vanity. Um, and then she says, you know, of course I'm gonna hang out here and live the party life. You will hear this transition, and there's a neat bit in the piano that is actually him singing under her window the melody from the first part, and she's just steamrolling it. She's just singing right over him. More spoiler alert is that she does end up moving to the country, France, with him, and uh, father begs her to leave him because his sister can't get married because he's living it in sin. Who knows, it's Catholic. Um, and, uh, and then, uh, in the end, he realizes why she's left him. Instead, he just accuses her of being a slut and leaving, leaving him because of that, not to save his family's honor. She finds him and because patriarchy, she dies in his arms of tuberculosis at the end. <laughs> women in opera. <laughs>